you made the cover of Sports Illustrated. You got an SB award. Can you just talk to us about these monumental moments that so many athletes around the world would love to have? You know, I feel like, you know, like I said, these are the blessings that come upon me. Leading my team out of the tunnel in a five foot blizzard, you know, snow all everywhere. Being able to be on the cover of Sports Illustrated, going to the ESPYs, sharing my story in front of thousands of people there and millions across the world. Being able to write a book, all these different awards. People always, you know, they tend to ask me, what's your favorite moment? And I still go back to when I was able to graduate from Rutgers with my degree in labor relations, and I was able to give the commencement speech in 2014 amongst all the, all the people out there and put that diploma on the wall for my mama like my sister did. And I was able to do the same because believe me, that was hard work. It was learning to adjust to different technologies, learning to trust other people's notes and reading through them. You know, a lot of things that when you, when you uh, become paralyzed, you got to rely a lot on your mind and remembering and things like that. And I was able to graduate from Rutgers University. I didn't let that hold me back. I had 60 credits at the time I got injured. I had to get another 60 more. And I was able to do that. And putting that diploma on the wall was the biggest moment. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Uh, you're an entrepreneur. You have so many businesses right now. You have the coffee house. You have the role model T-shirts. What's next for Eric Legrand? What can we look out for? You know, I'm doing a lot. I'm exploring. I'm learning. I said this is COVID time. Believe me, it's terrible. But it's allowed me to take a step back on my life and reflect. I, recently, I, I listened to an audio book last summer that really got my entrepreneurship mind going. And I don't know if, you, if you're familiar with the book called Shoe Dog, but it's by Phil Knight, the, the owner of yep. Nike, the creator of Nike. And you know, when I was, when you hear Nike, Nike's Nike. It's, you know, that, it's the top dog and all that. But I had no idea the trials and the tribulations, the struggles, the lawsuits, and everything that went behind the scenes of creating Nike, battling Adidas at the time. I didn't know Adidas was around before Nike. Battling Puma, I didn't know Puma was around before Nike. I had no idea where Nike's journey was to get to where it was in an 18-year journey to become that top dog. And then when I read, when I listened to that audiobook, I said, you know what? My life, I ain't letting anything hold me back. I opened up LeGrand Coffee House, you know, six months later. And we've been in business for about a month and a half with just our online shop. Business is booming. People love some coffee. We, a, we want to bring unity to the community with a daily cup of belief. That's our motto. And we want to keep on continuing to do that for people because with, when you look at me, you drink my coffee, you want to get that motivation, that inspiration and say, you know what? I can do anything. If, the, if Eric is going through this and battling through that, and you, I can do this too. And that's what it does. You, every time you drink my coffee, it reminds you. I created Shop 52, as you see, my role model shirt. I wanted something, something that represented me. Believe 52 has been my model since the beginning. But I wanted something that really represented me. And I thought, like, what do people say about you? Inspiration, motivation, role model. But I said, you know what? Let me put my little twist on it. As you see, roll, R-O-L-L, but my friends are E. Make that, make that O a handicap sign. I was like, yo, that's gold. That's dope. That's cool. And here we are, you know, we'll be a year and a half in the business with this. And you got T-shirts all over. You said, make, you mentioned Inky Johnson. Inky Johnson got him one of these role model shirts as well. And they've been all over the globe, all throughout the world, which has been pretty cool to see. So continuing to grow Shop 52, my new business endeavor with the Grand Coffee House. And we'll see, man, the sky's the limit, Sean. You know me, I, don't, I may be sitting, but I don't sit still. That's right. I love that. <laughs> I, I really love that. Um, where can our audience, I mean, this has been such a... a wonderful interview. It's been so inspiring and it is everything that I hoped and prayed that it would be. Where can my audience find you? You can find me on all my social medias at Eric Legrand 52. That's E-R-I-C-L-E-G-R-A-N-D 52 on my Instagram, my Twitter. Facebook is just Eric Legrand. My website is ericlegrand52.com. We got the energy. If you want to go to our shop, ericlegrand52.com slash shop Legrand Coffee House. Is LeGrandCoffeeHouse.com. And the main one that I'm most proud about is Team LeGrand. And that's continuing to raise money. You can find us at TeamLeGrand.org as we continue to help the 5.6 million people in this world that are dealing with some sort of paralysis. 
So one day we can live Christopher Reeves' dream, and that's a world with empty wheelchairs. I want to thank you so much for your time. I want to thank you so much for sharing your story. And I just want to thank you for being an inspiration, not only to myself, but the millions of people who have been impacted by your life, by your story, or have just come into your presence face to face. Eric Legrand, you are a true power move maker. Thank you again. Oh, I appreciate you, my brother. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.